Hey everybody, this is John. Thanks for joining today. We're doing just a quick overview and check of each hive and we're going to tell you and we're going to tell you a little bit about the story of the queens in each of these hives. Let's get started. This is a VSH queen. Um, bought this from a, a breeder in, in Indiana. And if this is the second year I've had this, this hive, a uh, little bit aggressive. This is probably my most aggressive hive right now. Um, I did a late summer split with these. And so they've been playing catch up all summer. And just trying to see, I put some food in them last week just to try to get them to expand a little bit. And uh, we're going to see how that's looking now. A lot of nectar up top and a lot of eggs down below. Again, this looks like a really nice frame that's going to be half brood soon enough. Okay, this was a hive that uh, was from an early spring split. And again, I bought a mated queen from a local supplier. Unfortunately, uh, not long after this this hive superseded, and so this one went. You know, I let it make their own queen, and uh, so this hive went some time without a without a queen. But uh, they're doing really good now. It's it's a daughter of a VSH queen. Yeah, they're just hopping out. This is one where you'd get stuck. All right, this hive is similar to the one we just talked about. This was a split off from the Russian hive that I went and I bought two mated queen from the VSH uh, queen breeder. I then installed them and unfortunately this one superseded as well. But everything seems to be going good now that They've, met, they've got a new mated queen back. So let's check inside. Well, we're just trying to see, are there, is there nectar flow coming in yet from the goldenrod is what I was hoping to see. And it does not seem like there is. Well, it's looking pretty. See the shiny? Hmm. This was a nuke that uh, obviously had a queen. The whole nuke came from Man Lake. Three actual three hives here. We got a nuke, another nuke, and one big hive. This is a split off of the original Russian colony that I first got when I first got into this. This side over here is a split off of this hive, which was a purebred Russian queen I bought from Man Lake. And then, of course, this one is um, a requeening exercise. This was a pretty mean colony. And um, I, I put, since this had such a big population, I put the, the purebred Russian in this hive. And then of course, the first hive that we visited was the original queen from this hive. That hive down there is also, it was a VSH hive that I bought, or a v, VSH queen that I bought. And the, that, that hive also superseded or swarmed shortly after, and I think uh, that was my fault. That was a great queen. Um, I, I actually had them grow up into three boxes. And I think probably just the queen pheromone got so low across three deep boxes that were completely full that that's why they decided to swarm. 